We are sailing on board Falcor, searching for underwater fire, and we're doing it here, the waters of the Kingdom of Tonga. So why here? Well, this is one of the most tectonically complex places on Earth, so we find a lot of different types of volcanism in a very small area. We have the fastest subduction zone in the world, the fastest back arc opening, and lots of tearing and breaking apart in the plate. If the scientists that first started studying plate tectonics would have come here, they probably wouldn't have been able to make sense of this place. Also, this is the only place on our planet where we find bonanite lava being erupted. Don't feel bad if you don't know what bonanite is. Most people don't. It's a very rare rock, and we had only found ancient specimens of it never a fresh one. It is a very hot, unusual type of lava and it is only found in subduction zones. Studying underwater volcanoes is not very easy, so we're using a variety of the best technology available. CTD casts allow us to locate particles suspended in the water and make measurements of the seawater's property and chemicals, helping us to detect the plumes of active volcanoes or hydrothermal system. AUV Sentry has taken high resolution bathymetry that enables us to have a very detailed view of the different shapes and features of the bottom. It also takes pictures and collects chemical and particles data which gives us information about the most interesting places to study in detail. With this new information and updated mapping data, we have a clear picture of where we want to explore. And then, we will deploy remotely operated vehicle Sebastian. Sebastian allows us to make high resolution video observations, collect samples, and make chemical and property measurements of the seawater. If we were on land, we could just take a backpack of tools and sensors to visit a volcano. Since we can't go two kilometers beneath the surface of the ocean to study these volcanoes, Sebastian is our eyes, our arms, and our hammer down there. On our underwater fire expedition's second half, we will send Sebastian to explore the depths of the Mata Volcanic Group on several deployments. The plans will vary depending on what we find, and we can barely wait. Volcanoes are amazing, and we are bound to discover things we never even suspected. 